All right, welcome everybody. Sorry for not the best lighting and sound over here in the warehouse. Very honored to produce and uh, show you guys the new Flesh and Blood Variety Kit expansion set. Uh, I want to show you guys a lot of cool pictures in the warehouse here today. Let you guys see what's going on. Uh, we got the new fancy schmancy play mats here to go with all the new kits. Sorry, at this time these are not. These are just going to be available by themselves. Although I might sell the taco in the future. I'm not sure. Thousand dollars taco. As everybody remembers, in the past um, we did sell. The original Flesh and Blood Variety Kit. We've been working with these Legend Story Studio guys a few months ago. The feedback has been phenomenal. People loved it. So I was like, dude, we got to do the expansion with the new uh, set and everything. So originally my biggest uh, complaint on the first one is that they didn't have any fancy watermark seals on their clear cellophane. But they've updated that and everything. Of course, made in Belgium. Good old card on Monday. Same as the old Wizards of the... Uh, of something I don't know I think you guys have heard of them but anyways let's show the new stuff here very excited to uh, include these new play mats and everything awesome stuff all right so out here in the warehouse I know I know you love the awesome floors you know what's best about it you guys like my feet look at look at that Florida look at that look at the hair look at that look at that okay sorry all right so uh, I'm gonna show you guys what's going on here we got crap everywhere I'm sorry this is just who runs this place completely bunch who's who's in who's in charge here all right, so first thing, these are what, if, if, uh, if a patron or anything buys a variety kit, this is what you're looking at. This is kind of my behind the scenes here, everybody. So, for example, you've got, look at this guy. He got angry. No, I'm kidding. He's just, he's on display over there. So, pretty much every order is going to have the infamous brand new Arcane Rising. Don't you guys love? They finally did the new clear cellophane with company logo. Absolutely love the upgraded quality there absolutely fantastic so i'm going to be doing these little variety kits essentially long story short those of you who are curious about this kind of stuff um i pretty much took a position of a couple thousand boxes and pretty much i think they're like what are they 85 80 85 90 dollars a box or something i don't know what that go on ebay 84.99 so essentially we're going to, the pricing is going to be a little different you can either choose one you can buy a not commander not commander you can buy a two pack I know. It's like, who runs this place? Two pack, you can see the double on there. You get more promos. You get the double play mat and all that fun stuff. So, if you buy a one pack, you get yourself a nice three booster box of the brand new Arcane Rising. You get the old brand new Rudy. Sorry, there's my face. I know it's creepy. You get one of the new play mats. And of course, you get a promo card pack. So, these packs actually have about, uh, I think, six promo cards inside each pack just to kind of give everybody an idea what's going on there so anyways to show you guys what's inside these promo packs so like i said each one has six cards in it so each promo pack you get four promo extended art cards where the actual has not i wouldn't call it full art but it is extended art through the text box versus a white regular so it's kind of i don't know i guess magic does the same thing so every one of my uh kits i'm selling is going to have these uh extended arts in it but here's the kicker so People have the choice of either, when I'm selling these, I built the single kit for one purchase. You get one of these, and of course, you'll have one of the, the play mats right on top. If you buy two, whoop, you get to go over here into the uh, the baller edition. You get the double, you get six boxes, essentially kind of a case. Double play mat and two promo packs. So it kind of uh, gives you guys an idea of what's going on here. So back on this side, I just want to show you. So the way I have it is there's four different promo kit. These are all the high-end cold foils. Uh, those of you who are not too familiar, this is probably my favorite right here. Oh my goodness, you guys seen this? I don't even know if it's... It's the, the cold foil has like a silver soft. They don't curl or anything. They have like a silver soft foiling to it. They're really neat looking. I wish you guys could see the better lighting, but unfortunately in the warehouse here, we have no natural light. So pretty much uh, you get one of the random uh, foil packs. You get one, you get, only get two. So if you, if you just buy one, you get two cold foils and the four extended art. If you buy a two-pack, as you can see over here, you get two of them. Now, obviously, for the patrons and people out there, if you buy all four, um, you or if you buy all, you can either buy one, two, or four. If you buy all four, you obviously, I'll make sure you get all the eight cold foil cards. Uh, these aren't too expensive. I would say the extended art cards are maybe what? Five, eight dollars a card. But these cold foils usually sell on eBay or the open market. On average, I would say those things are probably between twenty and forty dollars a card. That's where the big money is. So essentially, it works like this, everybody. Rudy's been spending all his time in the flipping warehouse, building this crap for the last two weeks straight, 
trying to make a bazillion of these things. Look at this. I'm like reusing. Look at this stuff. I'm like reusing the magic cases and everything. And I'm kind of tracking, as you can see, like, you know, the promo pack. So this one has the three and the four promo pack. This one. And here, oh, yeah, here over here. Check this out, everybody. Uh, here is the uh, the land before time. No, I'm kidding. This is all the damage stuff. A lot of people don't realize when you do a lot of pallets and things, you definitely get a lot of... Oh, this guy got crushed by a forklift, man. This guy did, too. These are the worst ones. But, yeah, so when we find damage boxes, we always put them aside. Not really much we can do, but we budget for all that kind of stuff. You know, unfortunately... Having shipping damage and forklift issues, that's just kind of how it is in this industry you're going to have, especially when you deal with thousands of boxes and orders. But I just want to share everybody, this is what's been going on behind the scenes. This is how this stuff works. Uh, this gives you an idea of the volume of what goes on. And like I said, it's pretty, it gets pretty crazy. I'm no joke. It's a lot of work. It's a lot of time to build and do these things. Um, but I think it's really cool. It makes it worth it. I, I'm really happy with this game. The secondary market's been phenomenal. The quality of the boxes things continues to improve. The actual card of Monday cardstock is great. Um, like I said, the, these two packs I think are really, really cool. So for people who are looking to collect all the promo type cards, let me let me go over here, by the way. Sorry, everybody. Sorry, I know it's a mess. I apologize for this stuff. I got crap everywhere. Let me I got hold on. So, I know I got, it's just flipping disaster. Okay. But no, like, oh, by the way, so over here, you can see, uh, these are all the other single kits I'm getting ready to go. I think I've got about 600 pre-made right here. Plus, we're working on these, um, these two packs around here. So, that's been, uh, to try to get ahead so we can try to keep things flowing pretty good. And ship times can stay within two weeks for everybody. So, you know, I'm not, I know, crazy secret layer stuff where it takes people like two, three months to get their crap. I think one to two weeks is the most you should wait for anything. So that's about it. Just wanted to share what's really going on and pretty neat, pretty neat stuff around here. But um, overall, I just thought it was cool. I know a lot of people just kind of like to see like packages and behind the scenes. And that is, that's unsanctioned. I don't even know how he slipped in here. I don't know what's up with that guy. What the heck is, like, it just keeps going like further back. Like, can you guys even see behind that wall? Like, what's, like, I think... Are those gift boxes way in the back? I can't remember. Anyways, but that's about it today. I just really wanted to share. So I'm going to be building these. Uh, pretty much the company, I know a lot of people say, well, Rudy, are you going to have an issue kind of like with the collector boxes? What if you sell too many in two minutes? Um, hopefully it's a smooth sale, nothing too dramatic. I'm going to run this time, a little nervous. but uh, And again, I just hope people enjoy it. The feedback was just so positive. I'm just really, I really enjoy working with companies when they have a really good product line and just you know, it's enjoyable and people are happy and it's just a nice thing to do. It's a nice change of pace and everything to work with companies and have questions and do that kind of stuff. So it's really all I have to say today. Not really a long video. I just know people like to kind of see a lot of the cool stuff that goes on and everything. And, uh, that's really all I got. That's really all I got to say. And of course, and of course you got the double infamous. I think that is a cool play. Man. A lot of people are asking me to like sell or do that in the future. I'll, I'll talk to them. We'll see what happens. But Hopefully everything just goes smoothly there, but that's all I have. Thank you very much, as always, for the support. Appreciate the kind words, everybody. And as always, uh, Godspeed. Be safe out there, and make sure you have some fun. And always remember, playing card games with friends and family, stuff's priceless, man. It really is priceless.